Welcome back everybody. Day 90. Can you believe it's been three months already since we started doing this? Man. So <clears throat> before I came out today I hopped on the scale and I don't know if you guys have noticed in the past few uh, since we start since the, basically the snow uh, melted away. I've been walking off the road. Man the wind is just howling right now. Um, I've been walking off the side of the road on the uh, dirt path and I've been doing that to build up the muscles in my legs more and just get more mileage out of the walks that we're doing and I've gotten a lot stronger and it actually feels like today as I'm standing here like I could actually jog a, a distance and I haven't felt that way in a long time so I just wanted to let you guys know that's one of the little tricks that I've done to you know get more mileage out of these walks that we do that are so simple they seem so simple but there there's a lot happening um, and <clears throat> you know if you guys are really numbers driven I would suggest taking measurements when you very first start um, a weight loss journey like this because your body's constantly doing something so just because you don't see major changes on the scale like if you're weighing yourself every week don't panic because your body is always doing something right so you're building muscle you're losing fat and your body adapts very quickly and at a certain point, your body is building muscle faster than you're losing fat. And that's what happened with me this month, especially walking off the road in this trail. I've built more muscle than I've lost fat, but we're still moving in the same direction. So I'm calling it a win. We're down another half pound and we're just going to keep trucking. So I, I wanted to just go over that real quick with you guys so you don't get frustrated on your journeys. So if you're real numbers driven, make sure you're taking measurements. Because I can tell you right now, I put anything in my pants pocket and my shorts fall down. You know, everybody that sees me is like, every time I see you, you look smaller. You know, it's hard to notice long-term weight loss when you're you every second of every day but it's the people who haven't seen you in a little while that's where your feedback's going to come in you know taking measurements stuff like that so this month we're just going to keep doing the same thing because it's working now i can tell you guys I haven't felt like I could jog or run in a very long time. <clears throat> but my leg strength is to the point where it feels like I'm getting closer to being able to do that. But the wind sure is beating us up. Looks like somebody forgot a jug of cooking oil on the side of the road. It's very bizarre. <clears throat> you never know what you'll see when you come out here, guys, I guess. So, take these little tricks with you as you go on your journey. You know, if you can, don't walk on the flat pavement. Walk on a trail. It takes much more energy and strength to trail walk because the ground's uneven, you know. Is 
it cold. Here's what we're looking at today. Look at those colors. Wow. Boy, is it windy though. Man, I'm having trouble holding the camera. Man, it's so cold. our sunset today. Man. It just never gets old, guys. <clears throat> Today's video is going to be a little longer because I was doing all the talking. There's a bunch of deer running off to the right there. See if I can get them jumping that fence for you. <clears throat> They're just two. I thought there was more than two. The others must have went down to the river. <clears throat> I know you guys probably don't know the area, but the just on the other side of that hill to the right, it slopes down and the river's right there. And then the other side of the river is one of the main highways. I'm sure you can hear the cars, maybe. <clears throat> yeah, guys. Don't get frustrated on your journeys. Just keep working at it. You know, I remember when I first started doing this, I could barely talk and walk, you know. <clears throat> but, uh, okay, let's stop here and leave you with that sunset. <clears throat> and I'll just tell you guys, you know, Right now, I'm still, I still weigh 330 pounds, so I have a long ways to go, you know? This isn't an overnight thing. It's gonna take, you know, at least a year to get uh, back down into an athletic range, you know, of weight. 
So just be focused, be determined. You know, if you're overweight like me, just know you're in it for the long haul and just keep at it. And you'll see results just like I have. And I'll see you guys tomorrow. And we'll do it again.